maybe right now you're thinking to yourself, oh, it's the morning, maybe I should do a selfie. <laughs> Is it a good idea? Is it a bad idea? Are you selfie ready? Uh, we're going to talk right now with Alexandra Nikolaev. Um, there was a selfie that went around the world, and that yes, selfie recently ha happened, and that was Ellen. Ellen at the Oscars. That selfie, just it was retweeted over two million times. It was crazy. It captured the universe. And, and now this is like a catchphrase, the selfie. And the for selfie. those, maybe there's a few right now that don't know what a selfie is, that's basically taking your device, going like this, and taking a picture. That's right. It's taking a photo at an arm's length away, trying mm -hmm. to capture that perfect moment, that perfect face in one shot. And I hear women, they don't do one shot. They don't. So CoverGirl actually did a study um, where 59% of women, you know, they take two to four photos. I'm more kind of like the eight to 20 photos because I know I need to make sure that it's perfect. But uh, yeah, you know, you want to make sure that you're getting your best face forward. Yeah, you're a fashion blogger at I'm uh, a little.com. Yes. And you kind of give some of the tips to be selfie ready. Exactly. So, um, you know, you're a blogger, you're kind of out there, you're at events every single night. You have to be camera ready. People want to take their photo with you. You want to capture the moment. Um, so for me, really, my biggest tip with taking a selfie is to be prepared. Right. Um, I'm a huge fan of this CoverGirl Skin Perfector Primer here. Um, it's just kind of kind of a base to your foundation. Mm -hmm. I have a lot of issues with shine in my T zone. So you know, me too. having that exactly. I do honestly. So having that is yeah. really perfect. It allows me to kind of be camera ready at any minute. Um, so I love that product. Mm -hmm. And the other products that are on there too is, is I guess it's not about too much makeup as well because it's exactly. so close, right? Exactly, it's so close. You want your skin to look flawless, that's first and foremost, but you do want to look natural. So obviously with all of these CoverGirl products, it's really just steps to creating the perfect natural finish. Mm -hmm. Is there a selfie limit? You know, there's some people out there right now uh, that are some doing... Some people should have a selfie limit, yeah. some don't. Like a weekly uh, selfie limit. I think yes. it should be one per week. One per week, maybe two on weekends if we're including that, um, but definitely a selfie limit. Something else I try to avoid is that duck face. You know, if you really want to kind of play up your features, something that I love to do is smizing. So smizing. that's smiling with your eyes. Okay. Okay, so I love playing up my eyes. I've got these big, bulging brown eyes. And so I love using the CoverGirl Bombshell Mascara because it's a one-two punch. Um, it's a two-step process that really allows you to thicken your lashes and create that big, bold finish for your eyes. Okay, we're going to help people uh, have the beautiful selfie as well. Definitely. Uh, and to help you look your best for the next selfie. Today, we're <laughs> giving away a basket containing the latest from CoverGirl, uh, Olay and Pantene, including some of Alexander's top picks, keeping your looking picture perfect. The basket is valued at about $350 to enter. Uh, we want you to have a spring-inspired selfie today. Get your device out there, take one, and we want you to put on it, hashtag BT spring selfie, and we'll select one at random. So. Are we going to take one? We're both spring ready. Okay, we both have our T-zones taken care of right this now. This isn't my angle. This isn't my angle. This is not your angle? No. You ready? want me to smile? I'm going to do Zoolander. Oh. <laughs> okay, we're taking a break right now from BT. Once again, hashtag BT spring selfie. Be selfie ready. We'll have more after the break.